Hello, this is Mike McGaver, and I'm here with my finds. And these finds are spread out over the last couple of weeks. I just uh, been so damn busy and hot and tired, and wasn't showing them when I got them, except for that last time, that last video rather. But anyway, I found this. This is uh. This is M2 Mallory Ignitions, and this is a Corvette. I don't know what year. Let's see, 1966, okay. A 1966 Corvette. And I, I picked it up for these extra wheels. And let me see something here. All right, making sure my finger wasn't over the camera lens or the uh, light, rather. But anywho, uh, I got that one. And... I got another one, second one there. Let's see. Got two of them. So one of them's going to go to Cecil. And I'll keep the other one. I'm going to keep all the tires and wheels. See, it comes with wheels already on it. So, yeah, he'll get it as is and uh, without these wheels. I'm going to keep the wheels. So, yeah. Uh, one of them was for Cecil, one for me. But anyway, that's those. And I found another one of these Cougars. And uh, I already got mine. And uh, I had sent off another one to someone. But anyway, I got this for the extra wheels. Yeah, extra wheels. So that's what those are. Extra wheels. All right, we're going to switch hands and hope I don't get my finger in front of the lens and everything so I can reach over here. There are things on my right. So anyway, those three items also, they were from O'Reilly's. So anyway, I was at Walmart one day, and I run across this, grabbed it. Didn't even know about this set being out. And wouldn't you know, it ain't going to focus now. And I, I uh, tried to make it focus on a video I was testing one earlier. It ain't seem to be uh, doing no focusing like my old one. I don't know. And anyway, it's a Bronco. Dang. All right. I don't know. It's, it seems like this camera is going to be just as junky as the other one. It's brand new. And it's... uh. Whenever I tried to f zoom in buttons, it just made my that gun video stop and start over. So I didn't hit them buttons. I don't know. But anyway, that's that. Ford Bronco. And uh, on the back here, I wouldn't mind having the Chevy Blazer and maybe the Ford Raptor. Uh, that one might be okay, but I don't care for that one. But anyway, didn't even know that set was out. So, anywho, uh, up next, I uh, picked up some more M2s. I picked this one up. Got two of them. One's for me and one's for Paul, the Mopar guy. Yeah. This is a 1968 Plymouth Barracuda Hemi Superstock. Yeah. Anyway, that's that one, and I also picked this one up for me. I only found this one. Sorry, Paul, you ain't getting this one. This is 1969 Plymouth Barracuda 340. So we got us a 68 and a 69 Barracuda. Yep, that and there's mine, though. And that, that Monday, I went back to Walmart and found a... Uh, couple more of those Chevy trucks. One's going to Cecil. I don't know about what's going to happen to the other one. I might trade it or I might use the wheels. Who knows? But anyway, I picked up the Camaro. The 67 Camaro. I got one for Cecil and one for myself. Yeah. I'm going to see if I can remove these decals on this one and, it'll be just, and put some chrome wheels on it. And she's just going to be a plain Camaro. I can do without the 68 on it and the big old Chevy emblem on the side. But, yeah, we're going to try it. If it don't work, then oh well. 
Anyway, up next, found this here Mustang. And this Mustang came with the, uh, in the set with that Camaro and the Chevy or GMC pickup truck four-wheel drive. As you notice, this blueness on this here package matches the blue on them, them boxes I got Friday or, well, uh, not Friday, Thursday or whenever it was. So anyway, I went to Target and I found this five pack. I got it for this year, Volkswagen. Don't care about nothing. Well, I'll, I'll take it back. I want this here Dodge van too. So yeah, I got this five pack for this Dodge van and this Volkswagen. The other three I'll probably get to my nephew or grand nephew, I should say. So yeah, that's that. And while I was at Old Rallies, I had went to Old Rallies almost every. I went to a, uh, there's five Old Rallies around here, and I went to a different one each day, looking for another tanker truck, which I did find, but I don't have it here to show. But I did find this one, and I already had one of these, and so I'm glad to have this second one. It's, it comes with the fork lift. This is the Matchbox diesel rig. And sorry if the lighting's, lighting's not real great. I'm inside now because that's where everything was at that I had to dig up. So anyway, and I've also got this fire truck. I really uh, ain't too fond of this fire truck, but it comes with an ambulance or fire rescue ambulance. It says fire department on it, but got that. So anyway, uh when I was over at the Walmart looking around for Hot Wheels, didn't find nothing. I also found this and picked this up for myself. So now I got my own self a Chevrolet uh, pickup truck, uh, SS, SS, Chevy SS454. You know, they got that RLC 454. Well, I can't afford one of them, but... Uh, I, I managed to get this 454, and it comes with trailer and a Supernova Gasser 67 model. So, yeah, glad to have that. Very awesome for an M2. This is the first time I ever bought M2 in a big old package like this. This is my first one of that, so I got that. And... Also, when I was at Target, I found this. I almost didn't get it. This is uh, the uh, Counting Cars, the History Channel. I almost get, didn't get it because this mag wheel here has got some slag up in the hose. But I'm going to see if I might can fix it whenever ever, if I ever open it. But other than that, it's pretty nice. 67 Camaro. And, uh, yeah. 67 Chevy Camaro RS. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I just kind of upset with the wheel, mag wheel having to slag in the hole. I don't know how I'd clean it out, but I'm going to attempt to one day. Anyway, I found this at Walmart. This is uh, another Plymouth Barracuda. This is a 71 model, Hemi Cuda. So, yeah, it's solid white with a little bit of got the black hood scoop thing and the black on the side no extra wheels though got that and when i was at walmart and this is the east side walmart i found this the planters uh this is a 59 chevy apache deluxe split side so this would be just like that real one i showed at the car at the at uh the, at the garage that they was putting tires on and put white walls on it. But anywho, that's what we got there. Planters Peanuts. Awesome. So anyhow, uh, found an I found another Camaro. This is a 1970 model Chevy Camaro Z28 RS. And it's uh, basically like that white one. This is an M2, by the way. So, yeah. It's got eight-spoke wheels on it. I may change them out to some Craggers. Dang, this camera.
And it seems like it's just the light on it ain't very bright. Or maybe it's too bright. I don't know. Huh. I don't know. Anyhow, while I was at Walmart, I found this, uh, you remember that Denty Moore van I found? Well, I found the Denty Moore Blazer there. It just so happened to be there, and I was very thankful to find that. Very awesome. Don't got to do nothing to it. It's already got chrome rims on it. Perfect. And then I had to open it up and get that rubber band off of that there. The top comes off. But I'll have to take that rubber. This It's got two rubber bands on it. So you'll most definitely going to take them rubber bands off. And I'm probably going to JB weld the top on like I've done my other blazers because I don't want it falling off and bouncing around and all that. But anywho, I also found this at Walmart. I'm going to try to remove the Pan Am off of it. This is just like that old Riley's truck. So, yeah, I'm going to try to make this one a plain Jane White. And if it don't if it don't come off and I mess it up, then oh well, it'll be something I'm customized paint someday maybe if it messes up. But that's what I'm gonna try. And when I was at Target, the last item, well, I got some more stuff, but it they're in I, I didn't stash them in boxes, dang it. I bought this twenty pack because they didn't have no Hot Wheels worth getting. They the pegs was full, but guess what? They wasn't nothing but a fantasy junk. And I know this 20-pack's got a lot of fantasy in it, but not really. It's about half and half. It's got this uh, Fiat 500, and it's got this, uh, that one. Uh, I don't forget what kind it is, but it's not a fantasy car. And then it's got, uh, this is one I wanted. I mean, I got, this is a Pontiac. I picked it because it's got this Pontiac. There's one that's a uh, real car, but I don't care for it. And then there's another one that's a real car, but I don't care for it. And then there's that one that's a Lamborghini, don't care for it. And that one there, don't care for it, that there's the uh, Acura. But I've got it for this year pickup truck. And that is a Dodge Demon. Sorry, it's behind that. But I got it also for this Volkswagen and that Ford truck. And I already got this one, so this may be a wheel donor. But yeah, went ahead and got that. The rest of these that I don't care for, they're going to get on out of here. Probably giving them my grandnephew, the, the fantasy ones. But anyway, that's all my finds that I got handy that I could show. Wait a minute. Let's see. I think I got one more here I can just pull out and show. Oh, this is just an extra one. I already got this. I went ahead and picked just another one of these up while I saw it for that Jeep. I'm going to do a wheel swap on it. I already got that one done a wheel swap on it. So, yeah, that's that. Got that five pack just as an extra. And so, anywho, that's about it that I can think of right at the moment. Uh, like I said, I got... Oh, I had found finally found the Volkswagen uh, set and picked up the T2, the yellow one, and also the Volkswagen Squareback, and one other one. I don't forget what it is, but I done stashed them um, in a box. But anywho, that's the way it goes. Yeah, that's the way it goes sometimes. Uh, but anyway, I got, I got some more wheel donors. I think I showed them though, when I was sitting in the truck one day, four green jelly things or something, a jello ride, upside down cake pan looking thing. Y'all know what I'm talking about. But anyhow, uh, I won't get on out of here for now. Uh, I want to thank everybody for watching tomorrow Sunday. I don't know if I'll do wheel swaps or not. The wheel swapping may be off until cooler weather gets back here because I ain't got no air conditioner or fan to even cool off. Only way I can cool off is the water hose. So anyway, until next time, this is MacGyver and I'm gone.